Hey guys, it's me again, and this is the Huawei Ascent W1. Technically, this phone is nothing special, since it features the same hardware as any other low-end Windows Phone 8 device. It comes with a dual-core processor by Qualcomm, clocking at 1.2GHz, 512 megabytes of RAM, and 4GB of internal storage. But what makes this device special is actually its software. It is the first Windows Phone 8 device to be hacked or jailbroken, or whatever you want to call it. Technically spoken, this is a full unlock allowing you to bypass secure boot to load unsigned firmware and custom ROMs. Two developers have accomplished this hack in two different ways. One of them has recently published a tool that allows you to unlock and route the Huawei Ascent W1 by clicking only one single button, just like jailbreaking the iPhone. Though this tool only works for the Chinese variant of the phone, so if you haven't bought your phone in China, you're out of luck. Another hacker has published this custom ROM that includes interop and full unlock, but flashing it isn't actually that easy. I tried it and nearly broke my phone, but to my own surprise it worked, and here it is. When booting the phone, you can see that the Ascent W1 is running a custom bootloader, and that even the boot logo has been modified. This Huawei Ascent W1 is running the latest GDR3 update, which you can verify by just taking a look at the start screen. By a simple registry tweak, you can enable the third lifestyle column and use smaller text and system apps. With the Tweaks app by Windows Phone Hacker, you can edit several registry keys by just changing a lever. For example, you can modify the volume limit on Reboot, allow saving maps to SD card, and enable data activity indicators. You can even change the boot logo, if you want to. Another app that makes use of the additional capabilities of the Interop Unlock is called App Data Manager. As the name suggests, you can manage app data that is saved on your phone. So you can make a backup of an app, delete app data to free up disk space, or restore an app from a previously made backup. Process Viewer is also a homebrew app, allowing you to see the currently running processes on your Windows Phone 8 device. You can basically just view your system and hardware information, and gather some data about system processes and see the privileges that are available to certain system applications though you cannot edit or close any of these. Finally, let's take a look at the modified bootloader, which you can access by clicking and holding the volume down button and the power button simultaneously and releasing the power button as soon as the phone vibrates. Via the volume buttons you can navigate through the BDS menu. Currently only some of these options actually work, like for example the shell, mass storage mode or rebooting the phone. There is no real custom ROM publicly available for any other Windows Phone 8 device at the moment, which is why I decided to do a review of the first one running on the Huawei Ascent W1. There is some great progress going on in hacking Windows Phone 8, which is said to be unhackable and looking at the Lumia smartphones, it seems to be true. They are really talented hackers working on it to bring even more features and possibilities to Microsoft's mobile operating system. And they have already been successful with the Samsung ATVS and the Huawei Ascent W1. Only the future will show if they will succeed with other phones too. Thank you for watching and see you next time.